Hey everybody, Mr. Smolin back again this week for our newest version of Storytime with Mr. Smolin. Oh, and we've got another great, great, great story coming at you again this week. Oh, you know what we gotta do first? We gotta get that drum roll. Drum roll, please. This week we will be reading Dog Breath. The Horrible Trouble with Hallie Tosis. And our author this week is Dave Pilkey. Dave Pilkey. Dog breath. Oh, man. I think this is a pretty funny story. You're going to have to wait and see why. Here we go. Let's get going on this. Okay. Oh, look at Oh, man. Oh, man. Dog breath. I know my dog, Ray, she's got some stinky breath sometimes. But let's learn here about Hallie Tosis. There once was a dog named Hallie who lived with the Tosis family. Hallie Tosis was a very good dog, but she had a big problem. Hallie Tosis had horrible breath. Wherever Halitosis opened her mouth, horrible things happened. Oh no, look at it. The leaves fell off the plant. Oh man, look at the goldfish. Oh, he doesn't even know what to do. When the children took Halitosis for a walk, everyone else walked on the other side of the street. Even skunks avoided halitosis. Look at that skunk saying, you halitosis, you got the stank breath. Oh man. But the real trouble started one day when Grandma Tosis stopped by for a cup of tea. And Hallie jumped up to say hello. Oh man, look at her jumping up with that stank breath. Grandma's coffee's flying. Ray likes to jump up on people too, but her breath will get you. Mr. and Mrs. Tosis were not amused. Something has to be done about that smelly dog, they said. Oh man, look at Grandma. Grandma's passed out from that stank breath. Poor Hallie. How do you think Hallie's feeling right now? I think she's probably feeling a little bit sad, maybe. The next day, Mr. and Mrs. Tosis decided to find a new home for Hallie. And their sign says, free dog to a good home. Look at them. They're sad. I don't think they want to do that. Kiddos are crying. Mom and dad are crying. The children knew that the only way they could save their dog was to get rid of her bad breath. So they took Halitosis to the top of a mountain that had a breathtaking view. Oh, I don't even know what I see it. Oh, it says wanted for burglary. Oh no, there's some robbers out there. They hoped that the breathtaking view would take Hallie's breath away. Here it says, breathtaking view. But it didn't. Oh man, look at the sun even. Oh, that must be some really stanky breath. Next, the children took Hallie Tosis to a very exciting movie. They hoped that all the excitement would leave Hallie breathless. Well, the movie says, Breath of a Salesman, starring Perry Odell and Ginger Vitus. Look at that. Uh oh, it says here too. More local ro robberies. Uh oh, those burglars. But it didn't. Oh my gosh, even the people on the screen could smell that breath. Finally, the children took Hallie Tosis to a carnival. They hoped that Hallie would lose her breath on the speedy roller coaster. And it says, you'll lose your breath 
on our roller coaster. Uh oh, I see something. I really like it out, Carnival. Oh man, hot diggity dogs. Ooh, I wonder if Hallie's gonna get a hot dog. Oh, oh, oh. look at it. She's having fun, but what's she doing? Making all the other kids sick. Oh. But that idea stunk too. Oh, look at all those kids passed out from that breath. The plans to change Hallie's bad breath had failed. Now only a miracle could save Halitosis. Sadly, the three friends said goodnight, unaware that a miracle was just on the horizon. Uh oh. Look at that picture. I wonder if we can get a clue. What do you see up there? Later that night, when everyone was sound asleep, two sneaky burglars crept on into the Tosis house. The two burglars were tiptoeing through the dark, quiet rooms when suddenly they came upon Halitosis. Look at those burglars. Yikes! Said one of the burglars. It's a big, mean, scary dog! Oh, don't be silly! Whispered the other burglar. That's only a cute, little, fuzzy puppy. The two burglars <laughs> giggled at the sight of such a friendly little dog. That dog couldn't hurt a fly, whispered one burglar. Come here, Poochie Poochie, whispered the other. So Halitosis came over and gave the burglars a nice big kiss. <laughs> oh man, look at those burglars. The next morning, the Tosis family awoke to find, find two burglars passed out cold on their living room floor. It was a miracle! Oh my gosh, Hallie. A stanky breath. It came in handy. The Tosis family got a big reward for turning in the crooks, and soon Halitosis was in the most famous crime-fighting dog in the country. Oh man, I love these papers. It says, Hero Hound halts hoodlums and bad breath bungles burglars. Panting pooch paralyzes prowlers. Mutant space dog captures evil Elvis clones. Oh man, look at the Haley. Oh man, it says hero. She's a hero for stopping those burglars. In the end, Mr. and Mrs. Tosis changed their minds about finding a new home for Hallie. They decided to keep their wonderful watchdog after all. And it says, this home protected by dog breath. Because life without halitosis just wouldn't make any sense. <laughs> oh, man, that's a great book. I love that story. Look at this. On the back it even says, bad breath is better than no breath at all. Oh, Hallie. I like that story. As you guys know, I have a pooch at home, baby Ray. And she might have some stanky breath, but... Do I still love her? Of course I love her. I hope you guys love all your pets at home too. But I really hope you enjoyed the story and I look forward to reading you another one next week. I hope everybody has a great rest of their day and I look forward to seeing everybody real soon. Have a good one.